All right, people. Cuddles, guard the entrance. Steve, watch for disturbances in the pulse wave differentials. Jerry, hit everything that moves. And ball arms, don't hug me. Oh, my God. Anyone? Anyone want to deal with this? Thanks, Cuddles. You followed your orders to a T. KO? Hmm? The TKO? You get it? Gives you nothing. Well, let's, uh, let's, let's keep going. <coughs> Stop. You hear that? Let's move. Jesus Christ. It was a dude. You got, that sounded like a woman, didn't it? It, it could have, it was clear that that was a woman. Seems like. <laughs> let's uh, let's let's just continue, everyone. Let's forget this happened. Freeze! Hold your hands up and go to a dentist. We're taking you down NCR headquarters. You wanted for multiple deaths and multiple deaths. And I've got a stack of caps as high as a bowel movement waiting for me there. Well, 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 if it isn't another mercenary come to kill the great Ratango, king of the rats. Shut your mouth. Your rat king is good as dead. Watch. Now what? <laughs> but my friend, that wasn't the rat king. Oh, really? Well, if that wasn't the rat king, then... That is the Rat King. Well then, looks like I get to shoot more stuff then. Let's roll, people. Yeah. What's the matter, bud? Rat got your tongue? Who, who are you? Who, me? My name? Well... I'm Tilly Voggles, and today we're doing a four for everyone. What? That's right, we're doing a four for McDorfer. And that first quest was a little bit- Who the fuck are you? You're insane. <laughs> oh, I'm not insane. I'm just doing my job. Good teamwork out there, people. We had some good hustle, and I'm kind of thinking we could start a basketball team on the weekends. What do you guys think? No input? Fantastic. We'll start tomorrow. Who is it? You know, there's a doorbell. Dumbass. Hello? Alright, I'm going out. Jerry, check the door. If I'm not back in 15 minutes, make the bed and turn on the heated blankets. I'd like to go to sleep immediately when I get back. Like those videos of the goats that fall down. They fall asleep on the grass. You guys want a goat? I may buy a goat while I'm outside. For a minute. Hello? Hello? Goddamn kids and their hip hop. Wait a minute. What's this? Oh. Oh. Oh, oh my god. Alright, everyone. According to the message we received, there's a large contingency of business rat roaches held up in a moving dump truck or something. I don't know. It's got wheels and it smells like ass, so I'm just gonna say it's a dump truck. They're just. I don't know. Do they not have money or something? Alright, this is a slash and stuff operation, meaning no sound, everyone. Yes, Steve, I know we don't know who sent us the... Steve, it's not a trap. Steve! Steve, shake your ass one more time, and we're not going to Nathan's tomorrow. Good. Let's roll this hot dog! Alright, everyone keep guard out here. Jerry, there's a minigun up there. You could jump on that and cover us. Me and Steve are going inside. We'll check the interior and let you know how things are going. 15 minute rule applies. Make the bed if we don't come out. As we entered the Machine Beast Day dumps, Steve and I discovered this was a moving arsenal. 
Finally, we stumbled upon what seemed to be the controls of the machine. Steve, take a look at this. A little baby helicopter. You ever fly one of these? They're freaking awesome. All right, let's see. Which one of you is up? Huh? Oh, I got it. Okay, let's go um, right. Hey, hey, where are you going? Well, screw you too, you slut. Bitch helicopter. Self-destruct initiated. Wrong number. Automatic fire death commencing. Ma'am, I don't know who you are. Dump truck explosion imminent. It is a dump truck. Feces melting procedure initiated. I don't think we'll be eating pudding for a while, Steve. Truck death closing in 15 seconds. Oh my god! Steve, this is a self-destruct countdown. Alright, bitch. I'm gonna give you to the- Alright, maybe- Sorry. Jerry! Jerry, let us out of here! Jerry, this whole goddamn thing's gonna blow! Jerry! Jerry! Jerry, are you cuddled? Anyone out there? Jerry! Jerry! God damn it. If I only had the debugger, then we could- Steve! Steve, what did you do? Off button? Alright, now you're just condescending. Alright, let's take a look at what we got. Oh my god. Steve, you see this? Yeah, I'm thinking the same thing. So sorry. Sorry. Sorry about that one. So sorry about that as well. I do apologize. Oh, sorry about that. So sorry. And this is where we're stopping. Congratulations. General Finton, that was my car. Yeah, sorry about that, but uh... Do you have any idea how hard it is? Sir, I'm sorry to hear about your sex life, but this is a matter of life or death. What? A what? General, I found what seems to be plans for an upcoming attack across New Vegas. And I've also got where it's being staged. Is this about the goddamn roaches again? Business rad roaches, sir. Holy fucking shit. How many times have we told you that roaches and suits are not a fucking... I say microwave. We now bring you a message from our sponsors, Dogglepon. That's turtle fast. Dogglepon, have you ever wanted to make a jacket out of bear fur? Bear fur. Dogglepon 5000 has 28 RPMs. That's turtle fast. Turtle fast. Each machine is handcrafted by a mole rat. Grown in our very own mole rat farms in Arkansas. Arkansas. So come on down and buy your brand new Doggle Pond. That's Doggle Pond Turtle Fast. Turtles. Oh my god. That was the most dangerous battle we'd have ever been in. I'm glad you boys were here with me. May God bless you all. So, General, as I was saying, I apologize. I think I'll take your offer more seriously. Let me see those notes. Good. Now what I'd like to do is rub some oil what down the lower- What the hell are you talking about? Your problem, you said you, something God about- damn it, no, not that, the roaches! Oh, uh, yes. Of course, the roaches. Come with me, I have something to show you. Since the NCR was formed, we've always wanted the best in our army. And starting two years ago, we've begun to get these soldiers, thanks to you. Excuse me? Subject 210, Gully. Found in a burning molten pit 50 miles from here. You know he's probably not doing jumping jacks. He's most likely having the biggest seizure of his life right now. Subject 151, Desmond. Oh, I'm Desmond, and I like to be boring. Subjects 204 and 321, Hoovers and Proxima. Why did you put the robots together? Are you guys racist or something? Subject 359, Niner. You know he does drugs all the time, right? He's probably having like the worst trip out of his life right now. 
Dreaming about playing the piano, dreaming about playing the piano. Not as not dreaming about something bad. Understands a snake. Subjects 259 and 249 Wolf Guy and Willow. So, why are they in a room together in the kitchen? You guys sexist too? Jesus Christ. And last but not least, one of our most valuable assets. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, he still got that fucking dog thing. You see that? We found the dog is a vital part of Subject 621. He doesn't function as well without it. Oh, my God. Look at that thing. It's like... It's like if you took a meatball and a dog and like those those strudel creams and you shoved it all together and you and the dog suffocated and then the, the meatball went up the the dog's ass and it was like I'm in control now. Oh god, what is, no one has killed Jesus Christ. Just close 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 the door. We also captured this Brotherhood of Steel base a number of months ago. It seems they had taken a keen interest in the area you mentioned the Roach base was in. Hmm. According to these multicolored triangles, the base is heavily fortified. Those super soldiers are strong, but not that strong. There doesn't seem to be any other way in, short of an entire platoon going with you. And I can't spare the men. Wait a minute. What are you thinking? You've got vertebrates, right? Of course. And a bomber? It's not in the best of conditions, and we don't have any payloads either. Doesn't matter. I've got a plan. Ball arms. Ball arms. God damn it. Get down. Ball arms. Turn the music off. God damn it. No. I, I, I apologize. Well, then. This has been an interesting day. Men, women, creatures, robots, kid, we are here on a momentous day, a day in which we take back what was taken from us. Even as we speak, they are selling stocks and buying lemonade stands simply to make a profit. And then, then what do they do? Do they stop there and become content? No. They take those from us, they burn down our houses, and they don't even give us goo goo bars. And although I know most of you have no idea what I'm talking about, I want to know, I need to know, that you, G Gully, Gully, no, damn it, Gully, stop it, Gully, no! Echo Roger Roger, this is Twinkleham. Do you have the base in your sights? Uh, Roger, Echo Roger Roger, we have base in sights. Lowering the package. Is the Chumpkins ready? Roger that. Chumpkins payload is in waiting. Chumpkins. Godspeed, my friend. Godspeed.
Well, well, well. Looks like we found who we were looking for. Prepare to die. Classically. That was a beautiful performance. I'd like to thank everyone that helped. Wonderful. John, that was great. You did a great job with the stereo. I really appreciate that. Unfortunately, we're going to have to shoot you on the face now. God damn. Looks like we found their weapons stockpile. Alright, let's split into two groups. NCR companions, your squad B. Stay here and take over. Squad A, let's move. You guys hear that? Get ready to rock, right? On my mark. Three, two, one, breach! Oh, oh my god. J Janet! Cause you Janet! Something or brother in your back in my life Even though you're not my wife, girl Janet! Something or other I don't know your last name Cause you were a robot You're alive! And, and preggers! I, I didn't know, I never thought- <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god, it just fell out like a worm or something. Oh my god, why would you do that? Was... Oh, 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 look, he's all neat and clean now, like a normal baby. He's, he's beautiful. Janet, I, I just wanted to say I'm sorry. Jesus, you still didn't fix your hair? You look like a grown-up cabbage patch doll or something. Jesus. <sighs> Enough of that, though. We got work to do. All right, people, let's get this baby in a box or something and shove him in ball arms. You okay with that, bud? Ah, of course you are. It's like an inside hug. Always pulling on your heartstrings. All right, let's load up, people. Move! Now, you're sure this is how they got away, Janet? I don't want to incinerate my baby eight seconds after I got him, you know? Steve, we good? What? Ah, son of a bitch. All right, everyone. According to Steve, this is the same time vortex machine that took us back to DC, but it's only got enough power left for one of us. And a baby. What a coincidence. Seeing as everything that I touch dies, I'm gonna vote for ball arms to go back in time and take the baby. Everyone in agreement say aye. Aye. Democracy at work! Now, ball arms, take care of my son, man. And maybe, just maybe, he'll grow up to hug you. Any last words? How shall I? Nope. Away! Great job, everyone. Let's tell the others. Hey, everyone. I just sent my newborn child back in time. With ball arms. He's gone. Uh, who wants to go to Chub Burger? Does anyone want to go to Chub Burger? Sorry about that, Mr. Radio. Hey, you guys hear that? What is that? After that, Squad B went back to the NCR, where they lived wonderful lives. Squad A? Well, we had a little bit of a joy ride. After we had sent ball arms back in time, I realized that I didn't tell them to meet us anywhere, or how to find us, or literally anything. I kind of just pushed them in the machine. I always wondered, would I see ball arms again? And what about my son? Where was he? Janet didn't seem too phased, though. Probably because she knew we could always make a new baby. A shiny baby. And one day, we might even see our son again.
Little did I know, that day was sooner than I thought. Ball Arms is gone and Janet is back? What the f Don't worry. He'll be back literally instantly. Don't worry. He'll be back. Don't worry. Don't, don't worry.